Well, this is a quick update for this uh, project and I'm working right now in the reroute approach. I have printed some parts here that I need for this and finally received my Aonico magnets. I'm gonna use this Aonico inside of this part and I'm gonna f I'm gonna fill this part with iron powder as well so I can I can make a, a complete path to the magnet flux the magnet flux will, will be able to pass to here but I need to wind this part so I can switch the polarity of the Alnico so I can open and or close them the path uh, the magnetic flux path to here and of course that I need a, a circuit for this and I have uh, designed this one uh, it's more complex compared to the previous one to the opposed flood circuit uh, I don't know if this one is uh, is correct I need to test it but the logic is quite simple when in the stick point area I, I'm gonna discharge the capacitor one in the, uh, in the coil to reverse our nickel polarity and close the magnetic flux so this one is the capacitor one and and when I discharge here uh, the polarity of the nickel will, will switch to make this path to close this path so the flux will pass through here instead of going to, to, the, to the rotor and of course that uh, while I'm just charging the capacitor 1 I'm charging the capacitor 2 and if I'm, I'm not in this tricky point area I'm gonna, I'm gonna do the vice versa which means that I'm gonna, char uh, I'm gonna charge the capacitor 1 and just charge the capacitor 2 in order to open the magnet open the magnetic flux so the polarity of this magnet uh, will be reversed to open this flux so the, the magnetic flux will not go to here and will and we'll need to go to the rotor well I'm, pre I'm going printing some parts right now but uh, I'm doing everything on, on my own because my assistant is taking a nap well that's it for now.